Welcome to Southwark Cathedral. I'm Andrew Nunn. I'm the Dean of Southwark and it's my pleasure to be able to welcome you back to the Cathedral as we reopen after the lockdown. And this very short video is simply to show you what you can expect when you come to the Cathedral because we're longing for your arrival. We're looking forward very much to welcoming you. When you arrive at the Cathedral doors and you'll be entering by the southwest gates, there'll be someone to welcome you. And as you come into the cathedral, please use the hand sanitizer. That will help us to keep the cathedral clean and safe. There are four prayer stations in the cathedral where you can go and say your prayers. Of course, you can say them anywhere else. The prayer stations each have candles, which are available for you to use. Um, there is also prayers there suggested as you stand there and pray for whatever your intention is. You can spend as much time as you like in the cathedral and then make your way out towards the northwest doors opposite the doors you came in by. There's a donation point there, there are other ones around the cathedral. If you can, please do support our ministry. It means an enormous amount to us. Finally, the one-way system will lead you down the link and out towards the Millennium Courtyard. Th at that point, you'll be le leaving the cathedral, but we do hope that you'll come back. The cathedral is going to be open from 10 o'clock to 3 o'clock every day. There'll be people ready to welcome you as you come back, finally, after this lockdown, to Southwark Cathedral. Thank you. We're really grateful to Lulu, who is a member of the congregation, for demonstrating how it will be for any of our visitors. Lulu is a nurse and she's been working throughout uh, the pandemic. So we're also very grateful to her for giving time um, on what was her day off. But it's important for us that you know that you're going to be welcome, safe and comfortable when you come back to this holy place where Christians have worshipped for the last 1400 years and we will continue to worship by the grace of God.